<laughs> yeah, so we're talking about anti-aging injections. So as a beauty editor and blogger, you are going to give us some tips on skincare products. Yes. And we're also going to test some products on skin health as well, plus find out how to delay the signs of anti-aging. Some of these give instant results. Some of them um, you do have to wait sort of six weeks, which I haven't had time to test for the full yes. six weeks. Um, but I do go on to a lot of review sites on Google. Um, for instance, this one, Philorga, Laboratoire Philorga, it's a hydro filler. Um, I think it's sold in Marks and Spencers, but I'll go through it in a minute. Um, I know that you, a lot of people have said you need to use it for a good two months, but the reviews are fantastic. They're really good. So, um, well, good yeah, to hear. yes. Good to hear. Whereas other ones, you know, you do get sort of like instant, instant sort of like results. This brand here, Fushi, that I've been testing, mm -hmm. um, straight away, it's a very well being, it's Ayurvedic, so it's a whole ritual. So, straight away, as soon as you put it on your skin, you kind of de stress, you can feel yourself just. Taking it calm, it's a bit like crying. I was listening yes. to Paloma Faith earlier, and the song is called Cry Baby. Oh, so yes. I went online and had a look, and apparently, if you cry, it relieves stress. Oh, crying! So I, I did cry. I mean, I went, I do cry an awful lot. I cry, I cry an awful lot. I'm going through my menopause at the moment. I mean, my oh, uh, well, I'm right in the middle of my menopause, so I did the hot flushes about a year and a half ago, had yes. all the blood tests because I had it really awful. Um, I didn't realize this, but. With the hormones, with blood tests, with it, with, with they can actually mimic pregnancy. Oh. So I, you know, th th I had it for six months. Wow! And I was like, oh dear lord! Oh, and you know, of yes. That. <laughs> and um, I actually went for blood tests, and it can mimic pregnancy. And the doctor turned around to me. She said to me, "You're right in the middle of your menopause." Um, so you know, sort of going through the perimenopause. So, at what point to, did you go to the doctors and and ask when, them? When, 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 I, when, I did, when I did a pregnancy test and it came out <laughs> positive. Oh wow! Yes, so it came out positive. Wow! So well, I, I can click it. Yeah. Oh, oh thank God! I've already my thank God my mum already knows this story. <laughs> And um, thank you God the boyfriend is like. Yeah. Me and I was, was like, Let's it was together. last year. It was last year. I was like, no, I'm on my own with my two children. It can't be happening. And you know, I've been with somebody for long. There was a way. There was a way around that, Molly. Yes. <laughs> refrain. Yes. Anyway, maybe it's with me. You know, I'm really honest. <laughs> I'm always very honest. God, I hope no one's driving their car and they know me at the moment. They're probably crashing the car or something. Oh gosh. Anyway, yes. So can we? Um, yes. Can we move swiftly on from there? Because so, I haven't got long. Um, right. So um, the first brand that I wanted to introduce you was um, Fushi. Now, Fushi Wellbeing is an Ayurvedic, it's a family recipe. What I love about this is that all their um, products are made and created in their London workshop. It's very ethical, so all organic. Um, so a really, really lovely brand. But this is what I call what I say is a well-being brand. So if you're into, um, you don't want all the additives and so on, this, this brand, the smell of it, I mean, is amazing, but it's a ritual, what I call a ritual. So you've got like the face wash here, which is the enzyme face wash, and they've sent me the radiant face cream, and they've sent me the radiant face facial oil. And with these kind of things, with aromatherapy, if you're gonna go down the aromatherapy route, I'm going to be honest, you're not going to get the results that, you know, anti filler okay. or anti anti wrinkle injections give and so on. But, you know, that it can help because it distresses. And as you know, stress is one of the biggest signs of ageing. Yes, so in that, that kind stress of thing. Stress lines around the Oh, house stress and lines. Well. And also, um, you know, and, and you can always tell if somebody has got that calm aura about them and so on. And I, what I love about this with the face, radiant face oil, which is what I was showing to you earlier, I, the way that I do it is I would put a few drops in my hat, in the palm of my hands, warm up, warm the oil up in the palm of my hands, and then just simply press it into your face. But first of all, take a few deep breaths to breathe in the aroma because it's absolutely gorgeous. Um, it's got in it um, Kalahari melon seed oil, it's got in it raspberry seed, um, it's got in it moringa, it's got lots of, all, all of these ingredients are well known to help with inflammation, yes. soothing, brightening, but they do it in the sort of what I call more sort of gentle way. The enzyme face wash that I washed with earlier, it's got a very gentle exfoliator in it. Um, so, to, you know, so it's all quite brightening afterwards. Um, but if you've been run down, I think it's really nice to have a brand where you just, it, it instantly relaxes you and it just makes you feel good. So for listeners who tend to use different skin products, so like me, I've got like oily skin and it changes. And I use one particular brand 
and then I use that for about six months and then my skin flares up again. Then I go and use another brand. So I just don't know what to do anymore. I would, advice? I would work. The first thing that you've got to do is, which is really important, why this is really sort of like a winter skincare, is you always adapt your skincare to the seasons. Mm -hmm. So in the, in, yeah, in the summer, you're going to need something that's obviously, I, I, I think most of the time you need something sort of quite moisturising, but if you've got oily skin, then obviously you're going to be sweating and so on, so you might look more into sort of cleansing products and, and so on. And that's the issue that I have. I yeah. tend to use the same product all the way through, and that's what it is. So you've just given it Yeah, you need to. <laughs> well, with things like, um, so instance, you get into your car, the first thing I do in the morning on the school run is whack up the air, the, you know, the heating yes. and it blasts my face, you know, and, and so if I'm sort of then walking the dog and I've been out in the freezing cold and then straight into the car with a heater on, the air, you know, with the um, radiators and so on, it's going to dry your skin out and your skin doesn't know what it's doing. It's sending all these different signals. Is it hot? Is it cold? And our skin is made to adapt to temperature. So you sweat, you know, when it's when it's hot, you know, it's all done for through temperature. So um, another hack here as well, beauty hack. Mm. If you have lots of pimples on your skin and then you try to cover those over with makeup and your skin's not breathing properly, what's your advice to women again? Right, I would yeah. always go to, first of all, I would get a very, very good cleansing routine. You do not want to strip the skin, your skin needs oil, but I'd get a very good cleansing routine. I'd get quite a gentle um, acid, um, maybe, um, not a salicylic acid, that's more, well, salicylic acid is, is more for sort of um, acne prone skin, so I'd go for a more gentler, um, acid. I'll go through those in a minute. Um, the other thing I would absolutely say is go for a minimal make, you know, sort of a, a minimal brand makeup, something that's going to allow your skin to breathe. So off the top of my head, something like Bare Minerals or Vitage. Vitage are very good. They sell that um, in Brentwood. So okay. if you want to go, or you can get it online, and um, they sell that at the, I think of the Courthouse Clinic in Brentwood. Mm -hmm. So um, go for a minimal makeup that's going to allow your skin to breathe. You do not want to clog it up, when, especially when your skin's already trying to fight to get all these toxins out. You don't want to pile it on. Now. <laughs> yeah, so, but this Fushi brand, anyway, this is available um, from, where is it available from? Um, it's available from Fushi, F U S H I dot co dot UK. The prices range sort of is around the 15 pounds mark, but there's something in there for every single skin type. So this is a brand that I would say is more for well being. So if you want to sort of, if, you, if you're feeling a bit run down and a bit, bit sort of sad. Yes. Um, the other things I've got, so I've got quite a few here and I'll try and whiz through them. Um, the other one that I sent you a photograph of the other day was this Maskologist London. It's a rose glowing potion. Now, I absolutely love this mask. It's a facial mask. Um, it comes in, you know, the sheet masks, so yes. it has your eyes cut out. The first thing I love about it, and I'm really sad here, is the fact that I could walk around the house with it on and it didn't fall off. So, <laughs> because, you know, when you're a busy mum, you just want to sort of, you know, put them. But the other thing I loved about it is that, first of all, it smelled wonderful. I mean, it's got rose essential oils and so on in it. So rose is very good for brightening and yes. it really does what it says. Um, it's very, very um, deeply hydrating. And it's expensive. It's available at maskologist.com. You get four hydrogel masks in there, and it is expensive. Each mask is about twenty pounds. Oh, this, yeah. the twenty, the, the fifteen minutes that I had this mask on, afterwards, my skin had that luminosity. You know, it was glowing. It looked amazing. So this has got. Um, so I'm just reading the sort of some of the press release here um, because I'm in a rush, but. Um, this basically delivers nutrients in the easy way for the mask. It allows the moisture to penetrate deeply for um, hydrating results. But I really, really like this. It's obviously cruelty free. As I said to you, one of the things that I was doing with the PRs last night, I was ringing them and emailing them saying, look, some of your products don't say if they're cruelty free or if they're tested to the European standards. And these are things that I need to know, you know, you have to, yeah. you've you've have got, to um, tell pescatarians as yeah. well so just be mindful of things yeah like exactly um so anyway this maskologist I, I absolutely loved it and i'd love to give more time on this because it really did work um the other thing i really liked about this which i read it doesn't say it on the back here but again okay. i looked at some reviews on it um afterwards you obviously get a lot of the product that's still left over you can massage it into your skin but you can actually put the sheet mask afterwards into the bath to allow Ooh, the bar, nice. so apparently it can actually sort of go into your body as well. <laughs> so the next brand that I've been sending, as you know, as I said, I've been going through my perimenopause, coming to my menopause, and my skin's been getting very dry, very slack, 
and as I had the flu and I am going next week mum please put your fingers over your ears if you're listening at home because you're never going to forgive me but I am going to have a look look at some anti-wrinkle injections for a feature you know so um, yeah, so, um, yeah. and as you know I have had it before my little frown lines come back I've been through an awful lot of stress up recently I bring up two children you know sort of on my own so it's very yes. You know, I've got and, and teenager well, and quite on. easy to get and quite easy to get rid of because I find if I'm looking at the computer too long, I do frown and I've seen yeah. one line. So yeah. then smiling and not yeah. feeling stressed, so that actually relieves yeah. the, the lines, doesn't yeah, it? Yeah, it absolutely. And I love laughter lines and I'm not one of these people, I, do, I cannot stand that frozen look. I really don't like that frozen look. But with the, um, you know, as I said, that's all coming back with the, with the hormones and the menopausal. And I said to my mum, I've been getting so angry recently. I mean, it's probably a good thing that I do live on my own, you know. But I do, I've been getting so angry. And um, <laughs> so... Um, um, as I'm is that PMT? Is that PMT? It's awful. I mean, things what... happen sometimes, oh. you know. Have oh. you tried like, listening to some therapeutic music? Oh, no, it's and... like mad. I mean, oh, okay. one, one minute I'm crying my eyes out. And literally, I was crying my eyes out to Silent Witness the other day. I was watching Silent Witness in bed, and my daughter came in and said, what on earth is wrong with you? And I'm sobbing my heart out. And it was something quite violent. And then Ooh. I'm really angry. And my poor kids are like, oh, gosh, you know, where's the swear jar for mum in the car? But it's hormones, and I know it's hormones. So this brand here is called Emma Pell, E-M-E-P-E-L-L-E. -E -E. And I wanted to give you some time because it's basically one of the only products on the market. It's the first known skincare range it's got this MEP technology it's basically um, when you go through your menopause or perimenopause what happens is, is you get a decline in estrogen so when you have a decline in estrogen um, it's um, you know there's a you can get dryness in your skin your, your skin get you, you know you get laxicity you get um, dullness it really does affect your skin um, and what this does it doesn't add estrogen to your body it actually, so it's non-hormonal, it's not got anything sort of, you know, hormones in it, if you're worried about that. Um, it basically encourages your skin cells to activate new estrogen. Oh, nice. And the results, the actual results, is it's got in it retinol, it's got in it peptides, hyaluronic acid, um, and basically on, again, I, I look always look at results on other people and all the studies they do, and it's really good, absolutely brilliant. Um, it's very good for fine lines and wrinkling. You do need to use it for, I'd say, about eight to ten weeks at least before okay. you get, you know, the results. Although some people have said that they've seen results sooner. Um, it is expensive. I'm not going to lie. It's expensive, very expensive. You're looking at about 135 pounds. But if it works, so. But it. But if this is for those that don't want to go down, or these are for those people that think, do you know what? I do feel much older than I am and I want to do something, but I don't want the injections. I don't want to go through the invasive or the you know more invasive procedures. So this Emapel is a really, really good make. Um, it's got loads of studies. Um, it's 93% um, of the participants agreed that it improved the impairments of their skin. Um, and it is, as I say, it's specifically designed to help the skin cells mimic estrogen. It yes. will not replace estrogen. <laughs> so if you're going out, if you're feeling very dull and you're just, you know, you just want a quick spritz of something and you want to glow, this is called Femme Lumi Mist. Now, if you shake this bottle and have a look at this, I know we've got the here. This again is um, vegan, so mm -hmm. it's great for that. So literally it's a Lumi Mist, it's full of hydrating ingredients. And you literally just spritz it on, and I'm going to do this. Ooh. Oh, you are, it's a camera. You can spritz it on, actually. Oh, yes. And it's got, it basically, that's what I call a uh, um, cosmetic kind of, um, it's for anybody. Ideal as well if your girls are going to prom, anything like that. It oh, literally it's gives amazing. an inner glow because it's got, Cucumbers. yes, mm. it's got a, it's got shimmering particles in it. They're light reflecting particles. Um, and what's lovely about it is, as I say, it can you can spritz it all over your skin. It's really good. You can apply it before makeup to help your makeup set, or you can use it as a finishing spray. Hi, it's Antonia Jones, and I'm Molly Miller, and we talk about beauty and lifestyle more. hacks and beauty products.
And we even try some out as well. Yes, and I try and get in some accessible brands so that they're good for absolutely everybody. Bye! Bye!